back with some more Dragon Ball Legends. So we're going to hop right back into the story mode and continue where we left off. We're starting off with, I believe, uh, book five? Yes. Oh, well, we're continuing with book five. Let's do it. Oh, yeah, that's right. So K1 and Khalifa were, you know, moved away by Shallot's crude act. And because of that, now he gets to face off against Deborah. So this shouldn't be a problem. Let's see how it goes down. Deborah, if it weren't for you, 17 and 18 would still be... Hmm. Ah, you're referring to the two androids that were absorbed by Cell. Goodness, you're still caught up on that. What? I was hoping you'd at least be grateful. It's because number 17 and number 18 died that you were able to fight Cell in his perfect form and grew even stronger. In fact, I think you should be thanking me. <laughs> you! How dare you! Such energy. To think he's grown this much. It seems letting him roam free was the right decision. Fine, I'll humor you. Let's play a little. I'm done playing, you horned freak! I'll pummel you into the ground! And then that's where we go from there. You got to destroy Deborah. He he exists. That, that, that's really good. Okay, freeze him. Do your thing. Yeah, this shouldn't be too crazy. But um, yeah, the sooner that we destroy Deborah, the better off we'll be. Um, like, granted, it would suck if you know he ended up getting petrified or Shall got petrified or they end up stealing his energy somehow. But it would block that one off. <sighs> Good old reliable story mode. They know exactly which one they'll give you. So they give you a solid card. And then after giving you said card, then they just block it off. That, that's, that's great. Wait, and I just realized too, the timer animation is uh, reversed for uh, when they lock down your card. Shouts to Blast Armor. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Die. Yeah, but uh, the timer animation, uh, animation, animation has been reversed because it used to be um, that the timer would go uh, clockwise to indicate, okay, that's how much time like you have to wait until you get your card back. But now it's counterclockwise, so I'm, small detail really does not matter. But I kind of just picked up on it now, so eh. okay. I won't let you survive. This is the end. Huh? This smell. It's the one from earlier. Hello? Who? So we're just blowing up islands. What was that? The whole island is gone? Sprite. There, there is no way in the world Bobbity is that strong. I refuse to believe that. There's no way. <laughs> Spry little monkey, aren't you? I know that voice. Oh, Boo is with him. Okay. Um, I didn't know if uh, Boo was like um, already like resurrected or maybe if he came from like a different era or something, but I had no idea. Now I do. Hello, Charlotte. I've come to put an end to you. And now we have to face Boo. That's not going to be good. Okay, chapter five, or book five, chapter five, Boo attacks. Do I really want to use Burner? Uh, you know what? Let's use this Frieza. Okay, I actually have a lot of teams of Frieza on it now. Christ. I see the girls aren't here anymore. Well, no matter. You've done your job well, Deborah. Now stand down. As you wish. So that was your doing, Bobbity? Powerful, wasn't it? It wasn't me, though. No, no, it was Majin Buu here. I'm not doing a Buu voice. There's just no way in the world. <laughs> Buu finna sound as normal as possible in this playthrough. So he's the source of that smell. Wasn't Buu the guy that Goku and the others said attacked Earth? Ah, uh, you must mean the Buu from before. The one that the other Bobbity released from his seal. 
This boot is different. He came to this era still sealed. Oh, okay. So, different timeline, but this boot doesn't like know, like, you know, right from wrong anymore. He didn't meet um, Hercule or anything. But thanks to the tournament, this era is overflowing with so much energy that it was a cinch for me to lift his seal. All right. His might is incalculable. You saw him obliterate that island, yes? Well, that's only a taste of his power. <laughs> Do you understand now? <sighs> There's absolutely no way you'll be able to defeat Boo. <sighs> Shut up, old man. Don't go celebrating your win before the fight's even started. I don't care who my opponent is. I'm not running. Hmm. You truly are a tenacious little gnat, aren't you? I guess your twins were Whoa, whoa, what you know about Giblet, though? Wait a minute, what do you know about Giblet? Twins? Wait, how do you know? But the other one isn't just brute strength. He has both brains and brawn. Are you talking about Giblet? <laughs> but alas, Ned is neither here nor there. I'm afraid your story ends here, boy. Come now, Boo. It's time to play. Torment him. Make him suffer. <laughs> hmm. B Boo, what's wrong? Can you hear me? Hello? Boo? Hmm? Hungry. Hungry? Boo, listen here now. It's playtime. Once you've had your fun, I'll give you all the cake you can eat. How about that? Really? Yes, of course. He doesn't seem serious about this at all. Just how strong is this blob? Didn't you see that attack? Bobbity was uh, was not just bragging. I can tell that's not his full power. The smell of that oaf. It's like he's got unlimited power. <laughs> Lots of cake for Boo. Okay, Boo will play with him. Perfect. Go, Boo. Right, look. Oh, he let the steam out. He's not playing. His key just shot way up. He said himself. Don't worry, Charlotte, because you're not even fighting him. Frieza is. So, you ain't got nothing to worry about. We're going to demolish Boo, okay? Boo has never been a threat. Okay, not to the boys. Not to the gang. Okay, we will destroy Boo. Effortlessly. Guaranteed. First attack, watch this. Oh, you got a king. We vanished those. Oh, would you look at that? First attack. King a green card would be kind of amazing right now. That he, he didn't swipe forward. Can you go forward? Oh. Slice. There we go. That was easy. It was easy indeed. Yes, Frieza. Okay. Um, yeah, so they finally introduced Boo. Like, I genuinely would have thought that we would have gotten a part six, and that would have been, like, the actual, like, Boo saga, because this was mainly focused on female warrior, but I guess they're just converging it all into one. Yeah! <laughs> that tickled. He didn't even flinch. Are Charlotte's attacks not hitting? Bye bye. Shoot. Charlotte, are you okay? <laughs> How do you like that? You don't eat, or you don't have a leg to stand on. D damn it! I can't just give up now. <laughs> it's futile, Charlotte. Look at yourself squirm. How pathetic. How utterly humiliating. <laughs> oh, shall it? And we go from there. I mean, low-key, that'd be kind of like a good place to like, end off the story. But um, it, knowing how story mode is, it's it's not. No. Uh, Purple unit? Oh, let's see. Do I have... Oh, Vegito! Vegito! Oh, we're just getting straight into it. Okay. I haven't used uh, Fusion Warrior in a very very long while so maybe vegeta will come in clutch you know what i'm saying put in work and uh call today let's do this 
Tell him. Back off. There we go. Demolish him, Vegito. I just realized, too, I haven't uh, knocked out my daily today. I'll see if I can, uh, like, get him to, like, faint. He actually took it. I was not expecting him to just sit there and take the attack. I was expecting him to vanish so I can get Rising Rush off, but it, it did not happen. It didn't. I wish it did. It would have been kind of nice. I mean, six times using any Saiyan character. I guess. I took no damage at all. I actually probably could have beaten that with a blue unit, but no big deal. Ugh! Oh, <laughs> finished already. How weak you are. Definitely the weaker between you twins. <laughs> Shallot, you're far stronger than you realize. You just need to have faith. We can do it. We can bring uh, balance back to the Saiyans one day. I just know it. Already on death's door, huh? I guess it's up to me to deliver the final blow. Don't you... Hmm? Don't you give me that crap! This ain't over yet! It'll get stronger! I need to do that! I can't just lose! To the likes of you! Yeah. B barrier Hey, he protected himself. He blocked it? Oh, you are you alright, Lord Bobbity? That that was close. <laughs> Shall it? That cockroach like persistence of yours is starting to get on my nerves. Playtime is over, Boo. Kill him and get it over with. <laughs> Okie dokie. Time to kill. <laughs> How unfortunate for you. Your death is imminent. You weak. Who will kill you now. Ugh. Damn it! Hmm? Splendid. You completely disintegrated him. Serves you right, Shallot. And that's what you get for making a fool of me. Ah, oh, what an exquisite feeling. What of the women who ran off first? Hmm. You can kill them if you like. I'm in such a good mood, I say we just let them go this time. We have more pressing matters anyway. We almost have all the energy we need. Indeed. Just a little more. One more decent haul should do it. I say we finish up a bit of- or with a bit of flair. So close. We're so close. <laughs> right. Um. That seems like it'd be preview. Oh, no. Okay. Next is dialogue chapter. I'm actually surprised. I, I kind of want to keep going. Because I, I genuinely don't know if there really is more after that. I should say. Wait, hello. Just as the world disappeared, I had a thought. Why did the gods not fight back? Why did the gods not protect? Why? Why must the world or, yeah, why must the world of ours perish? Where am Shallot? You're finally awake. Bulma. Jocko too? What's going on? Goku saved you at the last second and brought you here. Goku saved me? Yep, with instant transmission. You want to go save Shallot? I have to. Who's about to kill him? Fool! How many times do I have to tell you not to interfere? My life's on the line here. Don't worry about it, Lord Beerus. I'll do it so Bobbity doesn't notice me. In and out. Listen, I'm telling you Shallot's going to keep getting stronger. Even Boo won't be a problem for him uh, soon enough. Oh? And what makes you think that? <laughs> it's just a gut feeling, you know? A gut feeling? You're risking my life on a gut feeling? Just leave it to me, Lord Beerus. I'll be back before you know it. Wait! I haven't agreed to this yet! 
Goku took off without permission, so now he's stuck getting yelled at. So Goku saved me again. Bro, look, all I'm saying is Bob didn't even get body. I, I really do wonder, like, what he knows about Giblet. Like, because it, it's kind of weird how, like, Giblet's, like, going off on Shao for some reason. No, you're you're not killing nobody. Damn it. Charlotte, I can't keep getting saved like this. I need to get stronger. That fight with Boo made it clear. He's strong. Way stronger than me. If I want to win against him, I'll have to train like I've never trained before. <laughs> it looks like you're itching to go beyond your limits and reach the next stage. Goku. What do you mean by the next stage? Well, you already know that surpassing the limits of a Super Saiyan allows you to transform into Super Saiyan 2. And if you surpass that, you get... They are finally foreshadowing to Super Saiyan 3! Thank you! Super Saiyan 3! Oh, crap! Hey, Giblet! Hello again, Giblet. The heck is going on? Just a little more and we'll have all the energy we need. We have high hopes for that power of yours, you know? What the heck is that power? What? Hmm. Look forward to whatever you want. I'll use this power, my power, for the sole purpose of righting the wrongs of this ab- Hello? Aberrant history? What? I, I've never actually pronounced that word. I, I apologize if I mispronounce it. Nothing else. But, it's, okay, what is Giblet's motive? And then there's the preview. Okay, it, it made sense to finish everything up because, like, we were already at the end. And cut. That's a wrap on Part 5, Storm Calling Female Warriors. Looking back, Part 5 was a pretty big one. <laughs> no kidding. I hope the next story isn't as eventful. I need a break. How about a vacation side story? No! Are you kidding me? We can't just leave Bobbity to do whatever he wants. Ah, oh, good point. I've got a feeling the next part is going to be rough. Hmm. What's up, Charlotte? What have you been thinking about? Super Saiyan is what happens when a Saiyan surpasses being a Saiyan. Super Saiyan 2 is when a Saiyan surpasses Super Saiyan. So a Super Saiyan surpassing that is... What was that again? Super Saiyan 3? That means that a Saiyan super surpassing is super Saiyan super... Wow, that even confused me, bruh. It's just ascending past Super Saiyan 2. It's not that hard. It's literally what's 2 plus 1, 3. It's not that hard, shall it? Ah, I can't do this. My brain's about to explode. Point is, Super Saiyan 3 is freaking awesome, right, Bulma? I don't know. I couldn't care less about that. How could you not care? If there's something one, or if there's one thing we can count on, it's Shallot's consistency. Oh well, nothing left to do except take it easy while we wait for the next story. See you there. And from that, we are now caught up with all of story mode. There are no more events for us to do. There are no new units out, which means, yeah, I, I can't believe we're finally caught up. Holy crap, it took us a long while, but we're finally caught up on everything. So we can now anticipate the next portion of the story, maybe a brand new event, a new banner, whatever the case may be. But all in all, I do want to know what you guys think about all of this in the comment section below. Are you guys hyped at the fact that they are finally foreshadowing Shallot turning into Super Saiyan 3? Because I know if it was as hype as Super Saiyan and Super Saiyan 2 was, Super Saiyan 3 is going to be something else, bro. I, I actually cannot wait. But with that being said, I'm Itakuba, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.